even a little time. Have any of you not tried a case to verdict in a courtroom? Mr. Pitts. Um, have you ever tried a jury trial? I have not. Civil? No. Criminal? No. Bench? No. State or federal court? I have not. Okay. Have you ever taken a deposition? I was involved in taking depositions when I was associate uh, mm -hmm. at Wiley Ryan when I uh, first came out of law school. Um, but that, that was... Uh, have you ever... How, how, many, how many depositions? I would... Um, I'd be struggling to, to, to remember. Uh, Le but. Less than 10? Yes. Less than 5? Probably somewhere okay. in that range. Have you ever tried it, taken a, a deposition by yourself? Uh, I believe no. Okay. Uh, have you ever argued a motion in state court? I have not. Have you ever argued a motion in federal court? No. Uh, when's the last time you read the Federal Rules of Civil Procedure? Uh, the Federal Rules of Civil Procedure, um, I have, in my current position, I obviously don't need to stay as, um, um, you know, uh, invested in those on a day-to-day -day basis, but I do try to keep up to speed. We do have, uh, at, the, at the Federal Election Commission, roughly 70 attorneys who work under our, our guidance, uh, including a large litigation division. And um, as a commissioner, we oversee that litigation. We advise them on overall all yeah. legal strategy, uh, provide um, recommendations and edits to briefs and so forth, and meet with them about uh, how we're what, going to handle it. If I could ask you this, sure. I'm sorry to interrupt okay. you, but we're only given five minutes for five of you. So. Sure. When's the last time you read the Federal Rules of Evidence? The Federal Rules of Evidence all the way through would, um, well, comprehensively would have been in, in law school. Uh, obviously, I have been involved in, when I was a, uh, an associate, um, that was uh, something that we had to stay uh, closely abreast of. And um, there have been some issues dealing with evidentiary issues that sure. will, will cause me to um, examine those periodically in, in in our oversight role of the litigation division at the Federal Election Commission. Okay. Um, well, as a trial judge, you're obviously going to have witnesses. Yes. Can you tell me what the uh, Dobear standard is? Uh, Senator Kennedy, I, I don't have that uh, readily at, uh, at my disposal, uh, but I would be happy to take a, a closer look at that. Okay. That, that, that is not something that I've had to... Okay. Uh, um, do you know what a motion in limine is? Uh, yes, I haven't. Um, I'm, I'm, again, my uh, background is not uh, in litigation as, as uh, when I was replying to uh, Chairman Grassley. Um, I haven't had to, um, again, do a deep dive. And I, under, and I, and I understand, and, and I appreciate this, this line of questioning. I understand uh, the challenge that would be ahead of me if I were fortunate enough to become a district court judge. I understand that, um, that the path that many successful district court judges have taken has been a different one than I have taken. Mm -hmm. um, but I, as I mentioned in my earlier answer, I believe that the, the path that I have taken um, to be one who's been in a decision-making role um, on, uh, I would guess now, somewhere between 1,500 and 2,000 enforcement matters, mm -hmm. um, overseeing I, I don't know how many uh, cases in federal right. court yes, the commission is, has uh, been a party to during my time. Yes, sir. I've, I've read your, yeah. your resume. Um, just for the record, do you know what a motion in limine is? I would probably not be able to give you a good definition okay. right here at the, ta at the uh, okay. table. Um, do you know what the uh, younger abstention doctrine is? Um, yeah, I, I've that? heard of it, but I, again, so, that, How about uh, the Pullman abstention doctrine? I, I heard you're going to see, you'll all see that a lot in, in federal court. Okay.